What's up, you guys? Marty Schwartz here of Marty Music. Got a special request for you guys. We've got Oasis, Champagne Supernova. Great song. Uh, could be a great beginner song, too, besides being a great song. I think you'll enjoy I'm going to show you the chords and a rhythm, and we'll zoom in and do all that. Also, thanks for supporting uh, my project right here, Marty Music. Liking the video, sharing the video, spreading the word. I really appreciate it. Thanks again. But let's zoom in and break this one down. Here we go. All right, so we're going to start with an A major chord, suspended two. So it's basically just 2nd fret D, 2nd fret G, open A, open B, open high E. And then the second chord is that chord slash G. So it, it's A sus 2 slash G or A sus 2 over G. We get our pinky right here on the 3rd fret, so we get that note. And uh, it's kind of cool and convenient, the pinky pretty much naturally mutes that A string. Which is nice, and that's kind of what we're going for, or it is what we're going for, especially if we're playing this by yourself. The next chord is the A sus2 again, but now over F sharp. So we just use our index finger on the second fret of the E string, and this is still that same A sus2. And then the, the next chord of the progression is a sus2 over E. So we just make sure we get that open E in there with the chord. So you put that all together and make sure you get the open A for the first chord. And then over G. Then over F sharp. Then over E. Then same thing. And that's uh, the bulk of the beginning of the song. So let's get a rhythm pattern going, shall we? Down, 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 up, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, up, down, down, up, down, up. And lots of room for variation there, but I like to stick with a nice beginner rhythm to get you going, and then I recommend you you know, try and feel it out and vary it a little bit. You know, it all fits under that kind of pattern. So down, 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 up, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, up, down, down, up, down, up. Then you do it over the chords. And just emphasize the a string on the first one, that one, and on, on this chord, the A sus2 over F sharp, that index finger mutes that A string really nicely. And if you get the A string in there on that over E, that's okay. So, down, down. So, you know, one thing I vary is you can plant your pinky down and just pick through it a bit. The cool thing with these chords are there's no, if you're forming the chord right with your left hand, there's no wrong note to pick out. So that's, that's a cool thing. So eventually, when it starts to rock out and the electric guitar comes in, that final E that we've been playing, E over A sus2, becomes a full E major chord. Someday you will chorus, got the full chords. So it changes there when it kicks in. So one final verse into the next rocker section sounds like this. What we've learned so far, But now it's an E. Someday then an A chord. And this part can be rocked out more with like uh, 
down, 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 up, down, down. More of a down. So just something to think about that you can, you know, rock this part out more and it's an A major chord. Then a full G major chord. Then a D chord over F sharp. So that would look like this. So you're playing a D chord right here, but then your thumb is catching the second fret of the low E. And it's also happen happening to mute the A string for me a bit. So D chord with the thumb on the second fret of the E string. And then an E major chord. Champagne supernova in the sky. So A major. God believe the G chord. And then a D over F sharp. Then an E major. One more time we strum A chord. Then we go to G chord. Then D over F sharp. D over F sharp. Then the E. Now there's another section. It's real easy. No new chords to learn, but now it just rocks on a G chord. Da, 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 four, one and two, three and four and A. Now, so, you know, just eight counts on G to eight counts on A. Then the second time, G, then D, then E. Back to the top. So that from the last part of the chorus, G, A chord to G. D over F sharp, and then E. Now we're gonna go to G. Now A. <sighs> <laughs> And now G to D. And then E. Let's go to a regular E chord so we can practice the next part. A major, full A major, full G major, and then a D over F sharp, and then an E major. Same thing again. G chord, D over F sharp, E major. Now let's go to that G. Now there's one more rocking section, which is the guitar solo at the end. It's very similar to the chorus that we just learned, but it's A chord, G chord, then D over F sharp, and here's where it changes, F. We need an F. I'm going to play it as a full bar chord, but another way would be that way, would be three, three, two, and one and then a G chord. So that it's kind of the end rock out section. Now F, G. And then finally, it, it repeats the F to G three times like this. And a 
third time. All right, there it was, uh, Champagne Supernova. Thanks again for hanging out. Thanks again for supporting Marty Music. And uh, leave your requests in the comments below, too. I'm doing requests. This song was a request. And uh, I want to give you guys what you want. So thanks again for your support. And uh, we'll see you real soon.